Greetings, greetings, everybody. It's Eric Backer, all the way from lockdown New Zealand, where we're locked down. A lot of people don't like it. They sort of stuck in their own homes, but hey, I'm loving it. It's a great day out there today. I've got my veggie garden going. I'll be out there doing some more beekeeping and probably harvesting some more avocados later. And yep, the grasshopper and the ant. Remember that one? I think I was the ant. I was the one always putting stuff away in the cellar. And now I got heaps of stuff and everyone else is scrambling for food. Isn't it interesting? Now, how do you successfully can complete a candida cleanse while you're at home? Or if you've got a gut problem and you've got COVID-19, so you know you're locked up, you know, we've got this social distancing thing going on and we've got <clears throat> the inability to go out quickly anywhere and just grab some food because I mean, a lot of takeaway places are closed. Everything's shut. I don't know about your country, but in New Zealand, we only got chemists open, you know, drug stores and supermarkets and gas stations and that's it. Everything else is locked down. So what the hell do you do? How do you keep positive? How do you keep your gut in great shape? How do you go through a candida cleanse through the lockdown? Simple. This is the best time to go through a candida cleanse. The best time. Think about it. You can't get crap. Well, not in my country. The shittiest foods are unavailable. Isn't it amazing? We actually may go through some type of health crisis in this country. We might end up finding the diabetics are going to get better in the next four weeks, you know? All because of this COVID-19. Excuse me. And um, so, this is interesting. The lockdown, I think, is going to help a lot of people. Did you know during World War uh, II in particular, a lot of foods weren't available and people's health dramatically improved because they were literally going through intermittent fasting. They had limited amounts of food and what they did have was healthy. It wasn't crappy, right? I mean, Kentucky Fried Chicken isn't going to stay open during COVID-19. But in saying that, the great thing about this lockdown for many people is the temptation's taken away. Those candy bars are taken away for a lot of people. So basic food is what you want to do, okay? So doing a candida cleanse during the lockdown is not that difficult because when you think about it, if you're left with basic stuff like some legumes, you know, maybe some beans or some peas or um, you've got some meats in the freezer maybe, some vegetables, this forms the basis of the candida cleanse, okay? Because the sweet stuff's taken out. The stuff that you normally get around a lot of these places where you're gonna go shopping, so hopefully in your area, you've only got availability to supermarket food and not too much candy and Coca-Cola and takeaway food. This will improve your chances of a significantly better candida cleanse, <clears throat> especially if you're in your own home because you're away from a lot of influences out there, okay? Time for you also to relax more, get to bed earlier, do some more work around the house, okay? Don't just focus on eating all the time. Eat a few times per day, basic stuff. And this is a great time for you to get involved in meditation and rest and sleeping and some, some breathing exercises, right? It's a good time to get family together. And for a lot of people, it's gonna be an amazing time. Okay, remember, you haven't got yesterday anymore. Tomorrow is too far away. All you've got is today. And by focusing on enjoyment for today and being with caring and being around the special people in your life, it should really help you a lot going through the candida cleanse as well. All right, just remember the temptation is not there now, hopefully. So let's just get into it and get this candida cleanse done. Thanks for tuning in and stay safe.